everybody. Welcome to Round 6 of the 2017 ANZ Premiership. And this was a super Sunday down in Invercargill. Melody Robinson, Belinda Colleen with you. And we started out with the Magic Pulse game. Uh, just the one goal between them. The Magic won at 50 points to 49. This was a brilliant game to watch. Yeah, look, it could have gone either way, this, the, this match. And one of the stars was Monica Fortner, the youngster in the shooting at goal attack for the Magic. She got player of the match and she was just in sublime form and what was really impressive about her was when this game came down to the crunch in the dying minutes she stood up with confidence and took those shots and really um, sunk the ones that mattered to get her team in front. Yeah, I'm just loving the fact that we've got these young new names or new to people, uh, I guess, just standing up and delivering. Absolutely fantastic. So Magic won that one. Next game was the one that all the fans were looking for. It was the Steel against the Mystic. Now, this one was a bit of a surprise because the Mystics lost by 20 goals, 66 points to 46. Yeah, look, I think we probably would have expected a bit of a closer one. It was a closer one the first time they came to play. But defensively, the steel just had it all over the Mystics. And Jane Watson was one in particular who was picking up ball all over the place. She's got great help from the outside, but she's having a stellar season, Jane Watson. Lots of great strong rebounds. Let's not forget she had Mez and Tutaia Tutai in there to battle against. So a really strong one defensively to get them out with such a good win. Yeah, it's great that we don't have to talk about Janelle fowler for a change <laughs> uh, playing for the Steel. OK, our final match was between the Stars and the Tactics. The Tactics, of course, under all kinds of duress with their coach having left them. But in this one, it was the Star City 6-31. What was the difference there? Yeah, look, for me, again, defensively, it was a bit of a low-scoring match, but defensively, Defensively, the stars came up with trumps and Liana De Bruyne, the veteran in there, she won't want us to call, us, call, call her that, but she had so much experience and the way she leads her side out there, picked up so much ball, so passionate and intent. The tactics were good as well. I think it was their best performance so far. Um, but yeah, a good win for the stars to get their season back on track on a positive note. Yeah, so it was 49-44 for that one. A really good performance. Let's uh, wrap up all the results from round six. Round six isn't finished, of course, with a couple of games to go, but this is what's happened so far. That stunner there, magic by the one goal, and then 20 goals difference between the Steel and Mystics, and then the five difference between the Stars over the Tactics. So what does that do to the standings table? Well, the Steel remain in top, but the magic of the movers going up to second position on 11 points. The Pulse in third, the Mystics, down to fourth there and of course the tactics pick up that one point by their loss close loss well it's been a great round as per usual and we'll see you again soon for more 2017 ANZ Premiership